Geek and Sab on the drill. Morning, what's up YouTube? The day has finally come. I am two days out from the order shop show. I'm running zero carb for five days, mega depleted, feel destroyed. And now finally high carb day is here. So I've got 750 grams coming in today. So I'm gonna document an entire day's worth of food. So first meal coming up right now. I've got up early at five to get it in because we've got seven meals. Um, so I'm having 100 grams ground rice, 75 grams banana, 20 grams of whey, and 20 grams of almond butter. This is gonna be insane when you haven't eaten anything like this for five days and you're mega depleted. My weight since body power is down nearly four kilos, so I'm much more shredded than before. So it's gonna be exciting for the show. Um, so I'm gonna eat. This is the first meal coming up, so ground rice and whey. Let's get it in. Yo, what's up guys? So it's now 7.30, we're into meal two. Uh, I have got an exciting meal, chicken, rice, old school bodybuilding, and something different, Nutri Grain Bar. Uh, it's got 265 grams cooked rice of the Uncle Ben's Asmati microwave variety, and then 65 grams of chicken, which are plain, with reduced sugar ketchup. Check this out. So this is my last meal at home and now I'm off to work. So I have three meals there and another two when I get back. So full day of eating, chilling out, trying to do some work, take over the world, feel back out, feel better, a little dream. So I'll catch up with you at the next meal, which is meal three. Hi guys, so meal three at work. So we've got 100 grams, 12% fat steak mints, bagels, cinnamon raisin, of course and then 200 grams of white rice. So this is meal three, more carbs going in, feeling much, much more perky as the day goes on. Feel already back to my normal self after two carb meals. So very positive, so this is meal three going down. So cinnamon raisin bagels, steak mints, and cooked rice. Oh yeah. I've got to add the one added extra, which you have to have with every steak mints meal. Sriracha hot sauce. If you haven't tried it, it's banging. It's good. Meal four, car park coming up at lunch. 100 grams ground rice, again, 75 grams banana, again, 20 grams of almond butter, again, but a different variation. I love this shit and I bulked it out as much as possible to make it as big as possible, so I had to sack off my little container and get a bigger one, because that's how we roll. So that's meal four going in. I can feel my muscles twitching, glycogen filling out. I feel like I'm growing again, not like a scarecrow. So let's get this one down me. I'm gonna enjoy this using a tiny spoon as well to make it last longer. That's the secret. Okay guys, we're now on to meal five. So another chicken and rice meal. So you've got chicken, uh, 65 grams, 265 grams of rice. Another bad boy, Nutri-Grain bar. And going for the French mustard red hot sauce combo. So this is meal five going in, another good whack of carbs. Party time, no more work for me until after the show now. So it's a Thursday evening, I've got Friday off tomorrow, show Saturday, eat Saturday night, shoot Sunday morning, and then a lovely lunch with my wife Sunday afternoon. Um, so I've got now meal six coming up, which is steak mints again. I'm cooking a bit of a fresh batch. Uh, I'm using higher fat steak mints, which I haven't actually used before, well, for a long time. Uh, really nice, 12%. Uh, fat steak mints actually has an awesome flavor to be fair. So I think come my next time, I'm going for a growth phase, I'm gonna use the 12% fat instead of the 5% fat steak mints, just had a lot more flavor and probably just cut back the added fats to the meal, but um, it's a nice addition. So the meal I've got coming up now, again, another steak mince, uh, 200 grams of rice, and then a bagel. I'm gonna add some veg in with this one because I'm feeling pretty hungry. Uh, it's funny, having the extra carbs come in, so now I feel starving now, so. I just had a quick look at myself as well. Oh, did the light right. I, um, I look a lot leaner already, I'm starting to fill out again, so I've been, 
feeling my muscles twitch all day. Um, so I'm gonna get this meal put together and then enjoy this bad boy. And then I've got my man Michael come around to sort out my dodgy barnet for show. And then I've got one more meal before bed. So I'll get this one put together. Uh, There's another quick tip I wanted to add. I actually like adding uh, asparagus to the meals. It's good for flushing water. So what I do is use the scissors and chop them up into small bits and then pan fry that with the steak. I do it sometimes with chicken. Uh, you can do the same with broccoli. So if you chop it up into different texture, uh, adds a different dynamic to the meal. So try chopping up your, ve your um, veg with scissors. It does work well and you can pan fry it. All right, it's completely non-related to the fitness food video today, but look at this sneaky bastard. Aaron just loves chilling on top of my car. That's why I can't bloody, whenever I look at the top of my car, there's bloody cat fur all over it. Getting terrorized by bloody Ronnie, my cat. Back to cooking. Okay, so whilst playing with the cat, my meal is now done and finished. So this is meal six, steak mince cooked white rice bagel. I've also gone for the combo of mixing red hot and the reduced sugar ketchup. And we've got some greens, asparagus, mushrooms. All the good stuff you need in there for a nice healthy nutrition meal to get your carbs up. So this is meal six going in and I get through some client plans. Got a little bit more water to sip on, I've got about another litre after this and that's my five litres of water done. Um, yesterday I did 10 litres of water, the day before I did 10 litres. Tomorrow's most likely going to be looking three litres. So well, time to enjoy this meal and get eaten. Now this is completely not related to my carb up diet, but my wonderful, beautiful wife is making the most amazing thing ever. Cadbury's cream egg brownies, which I'm trying to resist. Probably don't get these in the US, but if you can, check them out on Amazon. But this is what they look like cut up. So the bad boys gonna go in brownies, and I'm gonna have to sit here and smell this for the rest of the evening trying to eat them all and hold off till Saturday. But they are literally like the greatest thing ever. And I've had them for about three, four years, maybe, Charlotte. But Every Easter. <sighs> I ate about 30 in one go once and nearly died, so that's why I haven't had them since. But these are gonna be incredible, and I'm actually excited looking at it. So, oh dear. Now this is literally insane. My mouth is salivating beyond belief. Check out how good these look. That is literally happiness in a plate. And the smell I can't even describe. Madness. I don't know how I'm gonna be able to resist this till Saturday. Oh dear. Okay, it's last meal of the day coming up. Just had my man Michael come round, freshen up the haircut for Saturday. Um, so, last meal, again, 100 grams of ground rice, uh, 20 grams of whey, going for vanilla flavour this time, by reflex. And then gonna go for nut butter, and try something different, pecan nut butter. Haven't tried this one before, so I like pecans. Fat content's a little bit higher, but there's much of much in this, so it's nice to have some variety. And I've also got 75 grams of banana on there, and also the cinnamon. So this is the last one of the day. It's now 10 to 10, so this is seven meals of carbs gone in today. Uh, looking a lot tired and full already. Got another day carbon up tomorrow, so more food going in. So excited to see what my weight does tomorrow morning, so that'd be interesting. But um, this is full video, so let me guys know what you think, and we'll go from there. Yeah.